Hi friends, I welcome everyone to this episode on Be My Eyes. Let us continue our learning about the app Be My Eyes. In the previous episode, we learned about creating an account and signing in to the Be My Eyes app and its various uses. In this episode, let us learn about the settings in Be My Eyes app and also learn some of the important settings in detail. So far, we have learned about navigating to the home screen in Be My Eyes app. In this episode, I am already on the home screen, so let's get started from here. In the home screen, there is a feature called Settings. Let us learn in detail about its features and I shall also demonstrate some of the important features. If you do not remember the options available in the home screen, I would request you to revise learnings from the last episode. However, let me quickly swipe right and show you the options available. Be my eyes. The app name is being called out. Let's swipe right. Call first available volunteer button. Use this option to call the first available volunteer. Let's swipe right again. Specialized help button. Use this option to connect with company representatives. Let's swipe right again. Selected home. We have reached the home screen. Let's swipe right. Stories. In this option, you will get to hear stories from other beneficiaries. Let's swipe right. Settings. Settings. This is the last option. These are the options available on home screen. Let's go to settings and understand the features and functionalities available. Let's swipe left and go to settings. If it takes you back to stories, then you may have to swipe right and get to settings. Stories. Settings. Double tap on settings. Settings. Selected. Settings. Swipe right and if needed swipe left to ensure settings option is selected. Now let me show you some of the important settings as part of this tutorial. You can explore and learn on your own about settings such as feedback. So let's swipe right and select settings. Settings. First screen name is settings. Section named profile. I touch the top left corner. It has a section name called profile which can be used to change name, email ID and other details. This is the first setting. Let me swipe left. Settings. This is just a screen name and hence we need to swipe right and get to options further. Section named profile. Nothing happens when you click on this as this is just a name for the section. Let's swipe right. Personal details. If you double tap on personal details button, it will display first name and if you swipe right, last name and further swipe right, your email ID. You can change or update these details by double tapping on each of them. I have not shared any personal details as part of the tutorial. However, it is similar to search box edit that you are already aware of and you can type in the field, similar to how you do on WhatsApp for typing messages. If you swipe right, you will find further options. Change password. Double tapping on this field will enable you to change or update password for Be My Eyes app. Let's swipe right for further options. Change email. Double tapping on this field will enable you to change or update email ID for Be My Eyes app. Let's swipe right for further options. Notifications. Notification settings lets you to configure frequency of notifications like daily, weekly, monthly, etc. It's not a critical feature and hence I request you to explore this on your own. Let's swipe right for further options. Section named languages. Section profile is already done. This option is for languages. It's a very important feature. If you select English as a primary language, you will get a lot of volunteers to help. Volunteers are also available in Canada. Based on your comfort, you can select the language. However, please note that pool of volunteers for English is the maximum as compared to other languages. Hence, it might involve some waiting period if your primary language is not English. In this episode, I have selected Kannada as my primary language and English as secondary language. Let me show you how. Primary language Kannada. Double tapping on this field will enable you to change or update primary language for Be My Eyes app. Primary language. Search button. As soon as you double tap, search button will come up and you can set the language that you want. Kannada, English, Hindi, Tamil, Telugu, Marathi, etc. If you know English, Please select that as primary language due to higher availability of volunteers. I have selected Kannada in this episode only for demonstration purposes. Let me show you how to change this. You will need to use the search button. Swipe left and it will take you back to the previous option. 
primary language. Now I will swipe right for further options. Search button. Double tapping on this field will enable you to change or update language for Be My Eyes app. Search language edit box. Showing English India QWERTY keyboard. Search box appears now and we can search the language that we want to set. Let us set the primary language to Hindi. I will double tap on this field. I'm already in the search field. Now let's search for Hindi by typing H I N in the search field and search. H A U I I N N. I have typed H I N. I will now swipe right to see if we can get Hindi in the search option. Clear query button. Use this option to clear any search that you have done. Let me swipe right. Suggested languages one of six in Hindi. Hindi two of six. Now you can see we got Hindi as suggested language. If you double tap on it. Hindi would be set as your primary language. You will also hear the click sound. Sound comes up only if the corresponding notifications are turned on. Otherwise, selection will happen just with a double tap. Hindi, Hindi. Selected 6 of 6 in list 6 items. If we swipe left, it confirms the language selection as Hindi. Hindi, Hindi. Selected 6 of 6. Now, I'll directly go back just after double tap. We do not have to press OK or other options. So how do we go back? Let's understand. Down and left swipe immediately. Then it goes back. English India QWERTY keyboard hidden. Let's do one more time. In edit box search language. We need to go back one more step to get to the screen where we set language. Settings. Primary language Hindi. Earlier the primary language was Kannada. And now, after we use the search language option and selected Hindi as a primary language, it is set. But we do not need Hindi. Let us change it to Kannada by double tapping. If you want to set English as your primary language, you can do so. Based on the availability of the volunteer, preference is given to primary language. Otherwise, secondary language is given the next preference and you would be connected to a volunteer accordingly. So, I am now changing the primary language to Kannada. When you request other languages, Primary language Hindi. Primary language. Now I will swipe right for further options. Search button. Double tapping on this field will enable you to change or update language for Be My Eyes app. Search language J, K, A, N. Suggested language Canada, Canada. English, India, Quiddy. Settings. Primary language Canada. Primary language is now set to Canada. If you swipe right now, it will provide description that we just discussed. When you request help, you will be connected to the first available volunteer who speaks your primary language. So first, the app will try to connect you to a volunteer in the primary language that you have selected. First preference will be for the primary language volunteer. We had selected Kannada, so first it will search for a Kannada speaking volunteer. If we swipe right, Other languages English, which means our secondary language. Suppose if Kannada speaking volunteer is not available, next preference comes to English. Use the same procedure like primary language to set up your secondary languages and I would request you to explore this more. Button name is called other languages. Let us swipe right. In the unlikely situation where there are no available volunteers who speak your primary language, we can try to connect you to someone speaking your secondary language. If you speak other languages, please add them here. These are the most important settings that will help you to use Be My Eyes app. However, there are some additional settings. Let me tell you about them. You can check them later. If we swipe right now, Section named Support and Feedback. Use this to share your feedback. Let's swipe right now. FAQ. If you do not know how to use Be My Eyes app and have some questions, double tap on this button and it will ask you to select the browser in which you want to open this. If you have only one browser, by default it will open in that browser. You can view this web page and see if answers to your questions are already there. Send us feedback. You can send your feedback for the app. Swipe right. Terms and privacy policy. We don't need this. Swipe right. Section named community. Next section is community. Swipe right. Rate Be My Eyes in Google Play. If you want, you can rate the Be My Eyes app on Play Store. Share. You can use this option to share the app with someone. Section named connect with us. Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, Instagram. You can connect on different social media platforms. 
version 1.3.283. This is the version of the Be My Eyes app that is installed on your phone. Log out button. Use this button to log out from Be My Eyes app. So in this episode, we learned different settings available in Be My Eyes application and also learned some of the important settings in detail. You can explore these options. In the coming episodes, we will continue to learn about the features and functionalities of Be My Eyes application in more detail. I hope you all like this tutorial. We will meet to learn further about Be My Eyes in the next episode. Thank you.